we are currently living in an energy extraction matrix, physically and spiritually. It's all to serve the Arconic and Reptilian parasites. The chemtrails sprayed in our skies are instrumental in creating this massive control grid. Chemtrails create an atmosphere that will support man-made electromagnetic waves through electromagnetic field oscillators called gyrotrons, ionospheric heaters, and Gwen towers. The ionosphere is an electromagnetic wave conductor. The Schumann resonance is a steady pulse of 7.83 Hz, which beats around the planet within the Earth and the ionosphere cavity. Humans naturally resonate to this organic harmonious frequency. It's very healing. But the ionosphere is being manipulated by an Alaskan transmitter called HARP. ELF waves from HARP, when targeted on certain areas, can engineer weather, create mood changes affecting millions of people, implant ideas into the collective consciousness, monitor thoughts, and further hide our divinity from us. The natural geomagnetic waves are being replaced by artificially created VLF ground waves coming from various ground technologies. There is a powerful electrical connection between the ionosphere and the lower atmosphere where chemtrails are sprayed. Chemtrails enhance this connection by making the lower atmosphere superconductive, and then, when HARP manipulates the ionosphere, the lower areas of the atmosphere can be manipulated accordingly. Chemtrails in turn poison us with heavy metals, more gelins fibers, and other nasty things, but the prime reason they're being sprayed is to reinforce an artificial control-based matrix. The electromagnetic grid is humming with unlimited power. The lines which comprise this natural grid are often referred to as ley lines. 